Von Fry, legendary badass, not shy, telling you how it is, Von Fry will die. You know, I was watching some NFL football, and I was thinking, this cat Sam Bradford, where is he? Where in the world is Sam Bradford? Number one overall pick, former Heisman Trophy winner, no exposure on TV. Now, granted, that was some seasons back, but did he ever get the subway commercials of an RG3? No. Did anybody ever talk about him on national television? Did they ever say shit about him on SportsCenter? No, they didn't. Now, there's two theories behind why this is the case. First, he's been fairly mediocre, but good at times. That's understandable, but how come there wasn't much hype for a number one and a Heisman Trophy winner? Could it be that he plays in St. Louis with the Rams? in flyover country, a small market where no one cares because we're bigots who live in Los Angeles and New York and we don't care about the middle of America. I don't think that's the case, guys. I think Sam Bradford is ignored because he's a Native American. Think about it. The Native Americans are one of the smaller minorities in the United States. Now you get to put a black guy in quarterback, you get to talk about black rights and all this. There's enough black people to cause commotion. Hispanics, Sanchez, come on. You get to have enough minorities in those groups to build a fan base that is lucrative. You gonna sell Native American to people? I think that it's quite a racist move if you ask me. Now this is the same league that has the Washington Redskins. Yeah, did you guys ever hear about the Philadelphia Brothers?